Lugal Banda, the father of Gilgamesh. This information is in relation to totemism in Babylonian religion. Zu is the bird on the totem pole. Many of the gods in Babylonia are pictured as riding upon the backs of certain animals, an almost certain indication that at one time that they themselves possessed the form of the animal they bestrode. But some gods retained animal form until comparatively late times. The sun god of Kis had the form of an eagle, and we find that Ishtar took as lovers a horse, an eagle, and a lion. Surely they were gods who were represented in animal form. The fish form of Awans, the god of wisdom, is certainly a relic of totemism. Some of the old ideographic representations of the names of the gods are eloquent of a totemic connection. Thus the name Iya Enki, the god of the deep, is expressed by an ideograph which signifies antelope. Enki is spoken of as the antelope of the deep, the lusty antelope, and so forth. He was also a water god connected with the serpent, a universal symbol of the flowing stream. The strange god, Uz, probably an Akkadian survival, was worshipped under the form of a goat. The sun god of Nippur, Adar, was connected with the pig and was called Lord of Swine. Merodach may have been a bull god. In early astronomical literature, we find him alluded to as the bull of light. The storm god, Zu, as seen by his myth, retained his bird-like form. Another name for the storm bird was Lugalbanda, patron god of the city of Marad near Sipara. Like Prometheus, also once a bird god, he stole the sacred fire from heaven for the service and mental illumination of man. So, Lugalbanda is Zu, the Shining One, which means Gilgamesh is the son of Zu. Apparently, there is little information on Zu. This is not so. There is a plethora of information. But only if you can accept this god has many names and many faces. Hence, I call him the Entity. The Hungarian-born creator of the Whispering Giants started in 1972, and his name is Peter Wolf Toth. Toth is a very common surname in Hungary. The meaning is Slav, so Slavic can mean people of Toth. The Totem Birdman. As always, food for thought. Please hit that notification bell to ensure you are notified of each upload. Share, like, comment and subscribe to support the channel. For more Ancient Mystery.